Well, it's time for Bring It On. So we've got it some is. questions. We have some email questions for you. This is a viewer, Gordon, who says in John 131, John the Baptist states, I myself did not know him. Do you think John and Jesus knew each other as children since they were second cousins? Is there any documentation outside the Bible that tells us this? Well, there's no documentation for it, but I, I think it's kind of obvious. Y yes, there was a point in time where uh, Jesus was down in Egypt, and, but then he returned. And we know that uh, from the Bible that he went to the temple uh, for his bar mitzvah. So if, if John is six months older than Jesus, um, they would have gone to the major uh, feasts, um, the Feast of Tabernacles, Passover. They would have gone to Jerusalem. And because they're cousins, they probably would have met. But to answer your question, we need to look at exactly what the, what the Bible says in the verse you quote. And this is John 1, verse 29. Uh, the next day, John saw Jesus coming toward him and said, Behold, the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. This is he of whom I said, After me comes a man who is preferred before me, for he was before me. Then he says, I did not know him. But he, that he should be revealed to Israel. Therefore, I came baptizing with water. And John bore witness, saying, I saw the Spirit descending from heaven like a buff, and he remained upon him. I did not know him, but he who sent me to baptize with water said to me, Upon whom you see the Spirit descending and remaining on him, this is he who baptized with the Holy Spirit. And I have seen and testified that this is the Son of God. Now, if we can go back to the part where it said, I did not know him, but that he should be revealed to Israel. That is uh, the key point here, that even though John was just six months older than, than Jesus, even though they probably knew each other uh, growing up, he says, I didn't know him. Because you, you can meet somebody, you can grow up with them even, but the revelation that he pre-existed John didn't happen until the Spirit of God revealed upon whom you see the Spirit coming and descending. That's the one. Then the great revelation came to John saying, this is he who preceded you. Even though he was born after you, he existed before you. The great revelation that Jesus is the Alpha and Omega, that in the beginning, he was with God and he was God. That is profound. And that's not something you get growing up with somebody. That's a revelation that comes from the Spirit of God. And so John reveals in the very verse that you quote, I did not know him, but that he should be revealed to Israel. So when you get under that understanding that he should be revealed to Israel, that there's a wonderful Greek word for revealed there. It comes by revelation. And the uh, Greek really can be translated, it's like turning the light on. Uh, you know, the scales fall off your eyes. That you finally, through revelation, understand Jesus is the Son of God.